I know what I would pick for you. Body, oddy, oddy. <laughs> you look absolutely body, oddy, oddy. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, we'll explain body yada yada yeah, in a please, moment. <laughs> we'll get there. But our style expert and author of Front Row, Louise Rowe, was handing out all sorts of awards last night. She joins us now to break down the Golden Globe fashions. Was colors the big trend of yes, the night? We saw primary colors. I mean, it was like a rainbow out there, which always is, uh, you know, music to the eyes, I suppose, because I love it when people are just bold. So some of my favorite primary colors out there, the big trend, Jennifer Lawrence in Dior. And I loved the cutout detail. It had that sporty element element to it. Yep. She wore it with a beautiful collar uh, necklace from Chopard, so many diamonds on that thing, and then matched her lipstick. It was a really uh, clean, elegant, but modern. I love the cutout. And I like the hair. Powerful, short, neat. Yes. She looked she great. She called it something. Not slutty power lesbian, which was yes. what she had been talking about her style being before. Uh, no, that was Hashtag not such SPL, it's out there everywhere. People want that look. Uh, Gina Rodriguez was another primary color. Um, she was in a beautiful midnight blue, kind of off the shoulder, big ball gown. I think we've got a picture of that later. Um, oh, there she is. And, oh, there she is. I do like that color. What is that color? It's like a midnight blue. Is it? Yes. Yes, okay. so it's a sort of dark. Greenish, now, too. Pockets as well was a big trend. It's actually quite a comfort blanket when you've got pockets in your dress because you can look how laid back she looks with I, her hands in her pockets. Jennifer like Lawrence that. and her sister had them. I loved it. I was looking at pockets all night long. By the way, she was with her dad, mm -hmm. and I was chatting with her dad all night. He was Gino. so cute. Oh, he was so She's sweet. She's named after her dad, Gino. Oh. Really? Yeah, oh, she's Gina. Cute. Um, yellow. We also saw lots of canary yellow. Um, a, a couple of them, the, my favorite, America Forever in Jenny Packham, a British designer. She looked beautiful. I think that America uh, really scrubs up well. And when she goes glam, she, she really nails it. And then another red lip. We're seeing these orangey red lips. Um, we talked on the show a few days ago about how there might be embellishment all over dresses. Instead of the necklace, it's actually attached to the dress. There's a classic example um, that was, yeah, Jenny Packham. But when you say yellow, I think J-Lo in the cape. Oh, that was killer. And we're going to talk about that later. Absolutely beautiful jumper Do it now. Bali. We need capes. Let's right. go capes action. We so, saw Cookie do it in the capes, beginning. And capes. I was going to say capes. Capes were a huge trend. Taraji in a gorgeous Stella McCartney white strapless gown. I thought she was going to do something different to usual and she did. She knocked it out of the park. Um, I thought her hair and makeup was on point as well. She looked no, she super looked sexy. Foxy. Foxy. Totally foxy. foxy. And handing out cookies on her way up to the podium. Mm. I just loved she it. Some boring Perfectly speeches before up. her. And then she came up and sort of yeah. lit She's the very room eloquent, up a little. But she looked she? relaxed too. Not too done up. Like I liked her dress exactly. with the whole Exactly. Her life. hair was actually quite ruffled and yes. tussled. Um, J-Lo. Jambatista wow. Bali. This was a chartreuse, which is that slightly off yellow. Um, we were actually talking about the color and the name for the color. But this dress had That's so chartreuse? much. Chartreuse? Chartreuse, yes. So much work to it. There was an intricate system of the little cape on the back. Then she had uh, sort of ruffles layered over the hips. She actually posted a picture on Instagram of her being fitted. And her stylist was literally, you know, getting her the shape of the gown around that gorgeous body. Um, she's so much fun on the red carpet. By the way, when I was in the elevator going up, I think it was her stylist, had a sewing machine. Somebody was going really? up the elevator with a sewing machine for last minute it, fitting. It does I love happen. that. More than you think. People get, I had to get stitched in. I, I had a little um, thing in my dress and we had to stitch it. Right you on the red carpet. Unbelievable little pearl of info. Oh, Bill, right I got there. plenty That's more a... of that. Stay tuned. Body, yaddy, yaddy. Okay, let's move on to uh, the ladies who oh, the bodies Kate on Hudson. fire. Kate Hudson, yeah, some yes. Family. Hashtag body, yaddy, yaddy. Apparently, it's a big thing with the kids. And uh, and yeah, Kate Hudson, our style star of 2015, rocked it in a gorgeous strapless peach gown by Michael Kors. Um, she gets the abs out, and so she should. And she, we didn't actually see that many cutouts and, and abs, sort of bare midriffs, but hers was absolute perfection. I think we're digging One for of that. And that color yeah. is hard to wear. Like it looked perfect on her with the makeup matching perfectly. Yeah, exactly. It's such a soft color. Her lip was that kind of peachy nude. You need to have a bit of a tan and the blonde hair. I think you know, just fresh off the slopes there from she skiing. Is. There's Kate um, over there. There she is. Oh and yeah. I, I mean, come on. Look at that. Another, That's unbelievable. A big trend at the moment is this choker having like either jewelry or a piece of material around the neck. And she's got that. I just love that look. And oh. there she is holding her best dress compact. Oh, which you gave her, which is great. Yeah. Amy Schumer, if we have a picture of her, she's in Prabal Goring. Now, we were talking about all eyes being on Amy Schumer. What's she going to do? It's her big moment. Look at this dress. Look at the shape it gives her. Yeah. Right? So you've got off and the shoulder. And you can see the shoes. I love the cutout for the shoes Exactly, at the bottom. Billy. No, you nailed it. Yeah. Um, it's an asymmetrical hem, so you can see the shoes, which is a big trend. More pockets. And the fact that those black panels on the side of the corset, they whittle down the waist, so she got an amazing hourglass shape out of that, and she nailed it.